I've armed myself with a prop for this particular video. Something that will remind you perhaps of other videos on this website. Something that I'm constantly saying to people that I meet. If you normally brush your hand with the right hand, tomorrow morning brush it with the left hand. Breaking small habits, changing small routines, breaks the automatic nature of the mindless way in which our minds normally operate. By deciding, no, I won't brush with the left hand today, I'll brush with the right hand tomorrow, or vice versa, you're actually stopping yourself in your tracks and saying to yourself, ooh, I have a choice here in relation to what I have to do in the next few moments. That's stopping yourself and calling to attention yourself and the fact that you actually have a choice in relation to something as small as brushing your teeth with the other hand begins to get in on you and begins to indicate to you so that you get a feeling almost effortlessly that actually I have a choice in relation to everything that I do. I can choose, I can decide how I'm going to act in every situation that I encounter with every person that I meet, rather than the mindless way I normally react to every situation that I think is going on, or every person that I think I know. I came across a piece of research recently that it takes 21 days to break a habit, or indeed 21 days to form a new habit. This gives us an insight into, first of all, how easy it is for us to stop doing the things that are getting in our way in life. The routine things, like brushing our teeth, get in our way, because as long as we brush them with the same hand without thinking about it, we perpetuate the vicious circle of our subconscious mind ruling or ruining our life based on stored knowledge that is decades out of date. If I started doing things differently, I would break those little habits. If there are big habits I want to break, that will enable me embark on a 21-day program to simply stop doing what I want to stop doing. But, very importantly, 21 days is all it takes to establish a new habit as well. And there are such things as good habits, or at least there's one good habit that I'm aware of, and that, believe it or not, if you've been looking at videos recently, you already know the answer to this. That really good habit is meditating. Meditating every day. Why? Because intensive meditation brings about mindfulness. And mindfulness brings about results.